Hi again. Okay, in this video, I want to go over tracking your food intake. If you've tracked your food intake before and you feel good, awesome, keep it up. If you're a little bit newer or have never tracked your food before, don't worry, I'm here to help you. So I really would prefer if you used the app MyFitnessPal. It's free, you just make an account, and then you just start tracking your food. It's really great because it actually breaks down all of your macronutrients, your micronutrients, and it even starts remembering some of your favorite foods. You can scan a barcode. It's great. What's most important here is that we actually get an accurate representation of what you're actually eating. I don't care if you eat salad every single day for the next week and that's what you show me. I, I will question it, okay? I just want you to track what you're currently doing. Your, your food, your meals, your snacks, your drinks, your alcohol, everything needs to be tracked, okay? This helps me learn you, your habits, maybe your schedule, and then we have a good starting place so that on our first nutrition coaching call, we can get right down to business, okay? Wasting no time. So like I said, my fitness pal is basically the ideal. Okay, that's what I would really prefer you do. Then you can easily upload that information to the Google Drive. If you don't or can't do My Fitness Pal, you can keep just a list. You need to be very uh, aware of your serving sizes and how the food was prepared, whether you cooked it yourself or you got it out, something like that. So if you're going to be tracking it, pen and paper, old school style, like I said, that's okay. You just need to be as detailed as possible and include the time of day, okay? The third option that isn't my favorite because you can tend to forget is just taking photos. If you want to take a photo of your breakfast and upload all of that, that's kind of our last resort, okay? Like I said, number one, my fitness pal, that gives me the most information and really can can obtain the, 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 mess, the best data from that, okay? So do that for a week. Like I said in the previous video, we want to include weekends. A lot of us have different eating habits over the weekend, and I need to see that. So five to seven days, weekdays and weekends, remember all food and drink, and have that to me 24 hours before our first call. All right, let me know if you have any questions. I'm here for you.